Welcome back to the Shane Plays Let's Play series of Sword Coast Legends Story Mode. So uh, when we ended the last video, we had come into this sort of mausoleum and it conducted a ritual that transported us to this lair, um, like a necromancer's lair that is part of Homet's, one of my NPCs, like personal story quest. So uh, we had a guy actually join us live kind of came in another real player last time and when we first came in here he just went and solved everything and didn't didn't really give me a chance to see what was going on um but you know it was only this part the rest of it is still left to explore um and and we are have a couple of level ups to do here so i didn't i didn't do the level ups last time because it was i was needing to go or the video had already been a certain amount of time i can't remember exactly what the deal was and and I think Olivia is actually help. behind a little bit in XP now because she wasn't here because when the other guy came in he brought his own character. So, but anyway, let's uh, let's do some leveling up here. All right, I've got three ability points. Uh, looks like I'm not raising my. Got a little bit of lag going on. Um, I noticed that when I was loading the game. Um, doesn't look like. I can boost one of my attributes yet. So let's check our our abilities and see. I've got three points to spend. I'd love to improve spiritual weapon, but I can't do that till level 11. I think I'm level seven now. What what level am I? Yeah, level seven. So let's see what I can do here. Healing word is rather nice. I'm trying to make him more of the combat cleric because Olivia has so far been more of my support cleric so let's see what i can do here divine smite is pretty sweet crusader's mantle reads the caster and divine power in an aura with six yard radius awakening courage and friendly creatures for the next 40 seconds the aura moves with and is centered on the caster each non-hostile creature within the area deals an extra two to five radiant damage hmm. What is this? Guardian of the Faith summons a celestial being into this plane at a targeted point. All enemies within five yards must make a DC 16 wisdom saving throw. On a failed save, a creature will take 11 to 26 radiant, or half on a success. Uh, they must make a new save each round, and it hangs around for six seconds. Huh. It costs three points to learn that. That's pretty sweet. I may do that. Shield wall. No, don't want that. I eh, don't want that. Produce flame two, costs one point. Turn undead two, that cost a point. Arg. I'm gonna. I'm gonna take this celestial this guardian of the faith that's pretty crazy i've got i've got to take that all right let's go to homet he's got three points uh and so does larathar so basically everybody leveled up but olydia bummer i suppose that's life it's the sneak attack three yeah i'm definitely gonna have to give that to him let's see what else is out there Expertise grants an extra plus six bonus to lock picking. I already known that. What is this? Slippery Mind grants proficiency in wisdom saving throws and a plus six bonus when attempting to decipher a scroll. Hmm. Disengage dodges quickly out of the way, increasing all damage resistance by 65% for six seconds. Uh, and for the next five seconds, all stealth checks gain a plus 10 bonus. Hidden Dagger 2. What is this? Misty Step. That's pretty sweet. Uh -uh. Love Misty Step. In danger, attacks foe, reducing their ability to defend themselves. Carouser. Two weapon fighting. Ooh, uh, I've already got spot. Oh, lock picking two. Hmm. I've got spot up as far as it'll go, or search. Yeah, I'm gonna buff his 
lock picking by one. this distracting remark oh, it costs three points this must be a pretty pretty core ability trickster infuses weapons with shadowy energy uh, archery that's not really gonna do anything for him there was something else I was looking at oh yeah sneak attack to learn that um, Dash channels adrenaline to augment running speed. Where was that misty step at? Misty step. Hello. Two points. I don't have enough points to buy it. So I'm gonna give him another point of lock picking. What is this? Hide. Yeah, I'll give him another point of hide. Okay, now let's go to Mr. Hommet. I can give him lightning bolt too. Oh, is this immolation sphere? Firebolt, where's fireball? Where's good old fireball at? Never having a fireball. I need immolation sphere, which costs two points. And that only costs one point to get up to another point of immolation sphere. Overlord channel, I don't have enough points. Uh, what is this? Static. Enhancers the caster's lightning and thunder attacks, increasing damage when dealing those damage types by two. Uh, I need two points. I'm going to double his Witch Bolt up. Okay. Close. Very good. Alright. Well, I need you to do your typical searching, and let's see what we can find. I love the sound. There's a... Uh, when these guys run across these bones, there's a nice crunchy... I don't know if you can hear that or not. I like that sound. Okay. Yes. Right. Here All we right, go. So what do we have over here? All right. What can I do for you? Old diary. Is that a quest item? Guess not. Let's go to miscellaneous items. Let's go to A to Z, Old Diary. Oh, there's two of them. Examine. Old Diary pages are mostly blah, blah, blah. Its owner had many adventures traveling Icewind Dale, among other places. Okay, so it's just junk. All right, let's check out the chest. A breakneck helm. 12% cooldown reduction. Well, I'll take it, even though none of my guys yes, can wear I'll heavy armor. Yes. Well, sure. Well, sure. All right. All right. Let's go check out the rest of this. Yeah, yeah. All right. Probably plenty of undead, seeing as how this is a necromancer's lair. Sure. Oh, hey now. If you say so. Let's yeah, move yeah. up a little bit, All fellas. Right. Let's get in front of the flames. What is this? Club of Poison. It's two-handed. Potion of Improved Healing. I'll take that. Sounds like a plan. Uh, anything Need else someone? going on around sure. here? What can I do for you? Joe. Skeletons. Vampire Spawn Mage. Hmm. Huh. Well, first thing, we're going to run Chuckles in here and do some undead turning. Or not. 
All right, everybody, let's get on Something this. Something I can do. Yeah, where's this immolation sphere that I just got? Where's that at? Darn it all. Okay, you are going to drop there. Where's my abilities? I want that immolation sphere. We're going to check that out. So you oh, yeah. are going to cast this cool new guardian thing. Where's your abilities? Where's that guardian thing that you just learned? Guardian of the faith. So you're going to cast that there. And what do you, you are going to cast your immolation sphere there. By the light of the moon! Comment, what happened yes. to your immolation sphere? I told you to throw it. Spell coming. Okay. Well, this is not good. <laughs> this is not good. I figured that would do yes. more damage. Okay, so now you're gonna turn undead, my friend. Uh, frightened a bunch of skeletons. I hear you. You're gonna heal him. This should help. Okay, the skeletons are all frightened, so everybody needs to get on Chuckles, the vampire spawn mage. You need to throw a magic missile on this guy. And you just need to attack. Everybody needs to get on the vampire spawn mage. Alright, now these skeletons are all frightened. Let's let our guys fight. Kind of let my guys do their thing. Heal me? Big spell coming. Yeah, I can heal you. Wow. What do you mean? Or not? I gotta I'm wait for that to reset. There we go. Okay, he got healed. All right. So let's select everybody and kill this skeleton. I guess they're not—they're not frightened anymore. This will be great. Big spell coming. I'm gonna try to turn undead again. I don't know if I can do it on the same. Yes, you can I? Yeah, they're frightened, so you can use Turn Undead on the same enemies more than once, which I think by D&D &D rules you can't. At least you used to not be able to. Uh, okay, you need to cast this, uh, is it Healing Word? You've already cast it, so I'm going to use my back, my non-main healing cleric to... Can I help? I hear you. Heal oh. my main healing cleric. Did you and need something? then yeah, I don't know, can you do any healing? I don't think you can. So how many something I can do? Well you may just have to Well no, there's plenty of healing spells here. I'll let you take one. Or healing potions, I should say. Trying to find a nice blend between, you know, micromanaging every move and letting them kind of, you know, take care of the battle on their own. All right, that was a pretty fun fight. What can I do for you? You can throw. Prayer of Healing. Will that heal yourself? Yeah, that heals herself. And... I'm here to help. Okay, everybody's healed up. Alright, Hamid, you, you are going to throw Animate Dead on one of these skeletons. He's debuffed for some... What's going on here? Eye gouge. He got blinded. 
That's not very need nice. Summer? Yeah, I need you to can I do for you? go back on point. That's what I need you to do. Boy, that so. vampire spawn mage is a splat on the ground. Yeah, yeah. He's just a he's a skeletal archer. What else is going on around here? All right. Let's take him out. What is that make you feel? I'll protect you. What? I'm here. Sounds like a plan. Sure. If you say so. Yeah, yeah. Oh, there's another skull. Oh, the. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, my dudes are just jumping these zombies. Okay, I was trying to figure out what was going on. All right, everyone. If that's the case, let's just Sounds get like everybody in here so we don't get all split up. Infected bite? Great. Wow, that hurts. I love this little celestial guardian yes. thing that I just got. He already threw his immolation sphere. So let's throw a lightning bolt at the vampire spawn necromancer. Oh, okay. Let's get everybody in here. My skeleton just ran in there. Fighting, fighting. Yes. I want you to throw your little guardian in there. So is it doing? I guess there, it's sa some of the stuff is saving, but the the guardian is doing damage, which is sweet. He's going to run in. And I don't know if I can turn undead on these or not. Yeah, frightened a couple of minor vampires here, which is cool. What is this thing? Oh, the mage. Now, let's see what I can do here. What's up? Uh, I want you, Hamid, to throw your thunder wave. I hear you. What do you need? Ah, oh, Larathar just went down. Did you need something? Yeah, I need you to use your revivify and go get Larathar up. That mage is nasty. I gotta get away from this mage. I'm here. Alright, we gotta back off. This mage is tearing us up. Right. Here we go. Run, everybody run. All run, right. run, okay. run, run, run. Yes. Nice. This mage. It's no joke. Okay. Yes. I need you to get a heal off. All right. Now everybody, let's take this mage out. Oh, there's a ton of mages. That's that's where all the damage is coming from. There's one, two, there's three mages. No wonder there's so much damage. I think, I think they're immune to sleep spells. Let me check. I don't know if I have it. Where's my bestiary? Vampire. Um, beasts. Really? I don't have vampires? My Bestiary. That's a bummer. I don't have undead in my 
as much as I've been fighting them. Oh well. All right. Um. I'm gonna run. Here we go. I'm gonna run Branner in and see if I can get a. Uh, where's he at? Yeah, you're about to turn undead in a second. All right, frighten one of them, frighten two of them. So let's take this one out while we have the opportunity. Well, let's take this one out now. Now, when something's turned or frightened or whatever, if you attack it, it it's no longer turned. How did that make you feel? All right, everybody. I'm here. Let's come back All in right. here. <laughs> that was a lot of fighting. Okay. Uh, first of all, Can Hamid, help? can you animate one of these? Let's wake one of these vampire spawn mages up. <laughs> nice. Court of Chill, 10% poison damage resistance. What can I do for you? Flask of Acid. What else we got? Healer's Kit. I'll take that. If you say so. Okay, that was a pretty good fight, though. Is it Lydia what or not? Yeah, she's still a little ways from level 7. Yes. I'm not going to let anybody yes. else come in on the my story mode. Oh. Like I did last time. I was like, oh, this is neat. Let's see how this works out. And not only did he run around and do stuff, like, without giving me a chance to see what was going on, but it threw off my experience for Olivia. So, okay. But enough of that. I'm here. Yeah, yeah. All right. Sounds like a plan. Knee cracker. Sure. If you say so. There was a yeah, drink yeah. or a booze or something called Knee Cracker in there. Z ghouls. Right. Sounds like a plan. I missed something in here. Take this. There's a raven feeblement on a ghoul. I'm not sure that that is the preferred method of dealing with them. More vampire spawns. I'm here to help. Well, then heal Hamid. What do you need? You need to heal Larathar. I told you to heal. I'm here. Like sometimes when I tell them to do stuff, they don't do it. Surprisingly enough. So what do you? What does this guy run way over here for? Larathar, what are you doing over here? Did you use Misty Step or something? Did I even buy Misty Step yet? Let's see. I'm not sure if he used. I don't know if it'll show on here if he used Misty Step. Larathar hits ghoul. I I have no idea. Okay, but my dudes are getting yes a little bit scattered. I'm gonna run in here and cast turn undead. Incoming! Okay, so I got two frightened ones. Let's put everything on this vampire spawn necromancer. Because these are all frightened. Okay, now let's take this ghoul out. Well, that ghoul's frightened. Yeah, let's take this ghoul out. Heads up! Big spell coming! Alright, now let's take the zombie out. Incoming! Alright, let's take the skeletal sniper out. How did that make you feel? You want some more? 
I broke a nail on that one. Alright, now let's take this ghoul out. So, well, right. oh, let's check Sounds out the school. Like Vampire Spawn Mage still has pretty decent health, so I'll stick with him. Jump. What is this? A dusty tome. A. So. Eh? Okay. Filter of self resurrection. I need to remember that yeah, I have yeah. those. I keep forgetting that I have those. Right. Dusty tome. Alteration Observations, Volume 1. Well, let's take it. Is this going to be a quest item? Yep. Examine. A Comprehensive Guide to Alteration Magic, Volume 1 of 3, written by B.H. Okay. So I guess I need to find three more. Here we go. Orders? I'm here. Something I can do. What do you need? Why does he not have? For some reason, I had him on unarmed. I'm here. Guess I accidentally need some hit Sounds the wrong like button. Sure. Sure. If you say so. All right. Sounds like a plan. Sure. If you say so. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Look, I missed some looting. All right. like a plan. Sure. If you say so. Yeah, let's go yeah, explore yeah. over here. All right. All right. Sounds like a plan. Sure. If you say so. Something. Yeah, yeah. I got that noise right. like he spotted something. Oh, he spotted another dusty tome, or was that from... No, he didn't. That was from before. Sounds but like I did get that kind of sound like he spotted something. I thought. Yeah. Maybe not. Hmm. Yeah, yeah. All right. Let's go in here and fight these goobers. Take him out. Wolverines! Lydia, where are you going? Your pathing is a little off here. Alright, you yes. are going to turn undead. Where did Lydia end up? Okay. Did you need something? Yeah, I need you to put some healing on him. And he's going down. Yes. What can I do for you? Looks like she's trying. Oh, she got him in time. Nice. All right. All right. So I'm gonna have him cast that guardian thing right here. I just really love that spell. It's super cool. Let them do their own fighting, keep an eye on their health. Larathar yeah. is continuing to take a little bit of a beating. So I'm going to drop a heal on Larathar. Awesome. Okay. awesome, of course, being part of the normal vocabulary of a medieval fantasy world. A zombie hit Branner. What? For five necrotic damage. Yes. There must be some kind of bug. 
You have my blessings. Yeah, because it was talking about zombie hitting Branner battle. Maybe there is no. Where's where's the zombie that's supposedly hitting Branner? This must be a bug. Because <laughs> uh, the combat is saying that Branner is getting hit. But anyway, prove regeneration. Regeneration. Whoa. Yeah, oh, it's all a trapped sarcophagus. Why not? Sounds like a plan. Sure. You may applaud. Disable the trap. Suits him. Valentin boots plus fifteen percent move speed, eight percent bludgeoning, piercing, slashing, damage resistance. That's kind of sweet. Take all. Who has what boots on? What kind of boots do you have on? What are they? Silent Stalkers, plus two to sneak. What do you have on? Plus two wisdom. 8% cooldown reduction. Plus one dexterity. I'm going to give you these new boots, dear, because they're pretty sweet. All right. Oh, no, no. I almost exited the game, which would have been a bummer. All right, but that is, with all these fights we've had, this is probably a good time to save. Yes. What can I do for you? Well, let's see what we want here. Actually, Hamid. I don't remember what this is. Oh, I got a vampire spawn necromancer. Why yes. not? What? All right. Sounds like a plan. Sure. If you say so. Yeah, yeah. All right. Sounds like a plan. Oh, what's this? Sure. Can I if get to it? So. Now, yeah, it's, yeah. That's happened before where All right. a body was like actually under the floor. Like a I don't know if that's a bug or Chill. what. If you say so. Yeah, yeah. yeah another chest that just happens to be no. laying there. Pushing him improved generation. Why? Regeneration in a belt. Right. Why not? Regeneration. Okay, some other just selling stuff. Cape of the Breeze. 25% fire damage resistance. Okay, let's check it out. Who's got what capes on? You've got plus one wisdom, plus two to sneak, nothing, and nothing. So let's give it to... Uh, let's give the cold damage resistance to Hamid since he's a ne necromancer. Let's give the fire damage resistance to Olydia. So, since neither of them are wearing anything. Oh yeah, and stuff happened so quickly last time that I um, I picked up the skull mask and the jack-o'-lantern, and I think there's like a broom. And it happened so quickly last time with the other guy that I never really got a chance to check out what I had. What does the sweeping fire do? Uh, deals one fire damage on hit, two through eight bludgeoning damage. What does the old broom do? So it's like... Um, The stuff that they did earlier, it was kind of like Easter eggs you could find in the game, like kind of cool Halloween-themed stuff, and I just happened to grab it last time, and I was going so quickly with that other guy being in the game that I never really messed with it. So, uh, let's give him the jack-o'-lantern. 
since he's my necromancer. And what else was it that there's a skull mask? Let's see what the skull mask. What does it do for him first of all? What is this skull mask? Uh, it just looks cool. So that actually looks better since he's my necromancer. But I took. What did I take off of him? Plus two intelligence. Ah, I wish this stuff was cosmetic. not wearing. He's got a helmet on. He's got a hood on. She's got a hat on. Er. It looks neat, but I don't want to... I wish it was just cosmetic. I don't want to mess with my stats. Uh, and then, where was the... I think he's got a flaming broom. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and then I think just a regular broom yeah neat but I don't I don't want to mess with my stats okay where is his skull topped is this what he was using yeah okay neat but I'm not gonna I'm not actually gonna equip any of that stuff what do you need all right Need summit. Need Sounds summit. Like a plan. Need summit. Sure. Uh, what's this? An urn? A whole urn? If you say so. Whoa. What the crap? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I can't tell if that's something that I... Right. There's a body there, but I can't tell if I can do anything with it or not. Oh, it's like instant death if I hit that flame. Yikes. So Hamid's down. Run. I think my... Here we go. Yeah, my <laughs> mage that I yes. was, uh, that I had animated got dropped too. Uh, all right. All thanks to the Lady of Dreams. I thought I was dead. Oh, oh, let's get them out sorry of there. Sorry, guys. Oh, not again. Your orders? Are we still fighting? Yes, run, run, run. Here we go. What do you need? Run, run, Hamid. All right. Ooh, we. Nasty stuff. I'm here to help. I'm here. Important safety tip. Yes. Okay. Don't get in the flames. They never learn, do they? Important safety tip. Oh, and then all of this stuff suddenly pops up. Great. All right, Brandon, run in here, and you're going to do some zombie. You're going to do some turning of the undead. Okay, this stuff. These are frightened, right? Yeah. So let's let's all focus on one that is not frightened. I need help. Oh, this is not good. Uh, yes. Hamid, throw your immolation sphere yep. here. Take this. I go. This is not a good fight. How did that make you feel? Uh, it didn't. It didn't make me feel good at all. Okay, I have self. Filter of self-resurrection. There it is. I'm going to use that. Okay. So he's back up. This is a tough fight. What have I What's done that? here, Hamid? Oh, 
how does this work? I can't, I can't figure out how to aim this. There it goes, okay. Yeah, this is not, I'm not doing so hot. This fight's a little pear-shaped. Okay, what can I do here? Can I help? Yeah, you can. Sure. Actually, you can go over here, and then you can. I want you to move here, Hamid, and then I want you to Thunder Wave. I was hoping it would knock these guys off, but I guess it doesn't yes. work like that. You need to take a healing potion. Uh, you're going to cast... Hmm, this guardian thing right here. Yes. You're going to throw... I don't have prayer of healing. I've already used it. You're going to throw Bless. I hear you. What do you need? I need you to heal her. That's what I need you to do. Something I can do. Yeah. Let's see. Potion of Shadows. Flask of Oil. What is this? Scroll of Animate Dead. Potion of Frost Giant Strength. I think I'm going to have to have you take that, pal. I'm going to have you take that Potion of Frost Giant Strength. What, what do you need? Man, I guess I just need you to go to Witch Bolts on these guys. Because I don't think I can put any of these things to sleep. Can you sneak attack? What can you do? Potion of Shadows. Prove Regeneration. You're going to take one of these two. And get tough all of a sudden. Yes? Gotta get some of these dudes down. Okay. Did you need something? Yeah, Olivia, I need you helping with these snipers. Can you shoot up that way? And Olivia's down. Crud. Okay. Uh, you are going to use one of these filters of self-resurrection. Those are nice. <laughs> Those are really, really, really nice. Uh, and I, I need you helping with these guys. I need you helping with Hamid up here, Lydia. That's what I need you doing. Now, can you do an can you do another turn undead yet, Branner? I need you to run over here I'm and turn undead. Hurt, you guys. Yeah, I know you are, dude. Okay, I got two of them frightened with that turn undead. Need some. Yeah, Larathar, I need you to get on this Vampire Spawn. Necromancer, Branner, I need you to do the same thing. Hummet, I need you to take a potion of healing. What can I do for you? Larathar, yes. can, you need to take a potion of healing. And you need to take a potion of healing. Okay. And then... No, nope, Larathar, I want you on the Vampire Spawn Necromancer. And Branner, yes. I want you on it too. To help battle Lydia. Oh. 
Okay, one of these guys is down. So get on this one. And then I Lydia, I need you to get on this one. Actually, I need you to heal this guy. <laughs> and he's down. He's down. Alright, let's thin some of this out. I'm going through a lot of potions on this fight. I my potion of healing. There we go. Use something. Yeah, I need you to take that. And I need you to heal yourself. What do you need? Okay. Larathar, I need you to get Hamid up. Branner, I need you to run down here. No, Larathar. Need some up. Wake up, Hamid. Why would you even run? I don't even understand why you would run off. Alright, yes. Branner, head All down right. here. I want everybody to head down here. Okay. It's redonkulous. Yeah, sweetheart, you can cast Prayer of Healing. I broke a nail on that one. That helped everybody. What do you Hamid, need? I need you on that guy. I'm here to help. I need you on that guy. Oh. You two are gonna take out these zombies. Best one yet. Man, that was a freaking fight. That was redonkulous. Yes. Felt good to beat it. All right, All right. Hamid, come in here without getting blasted. I'm wondering, is there something over, you know, what's... I don't even know if there's something over there that I can... Is it just some weird trap that's not protecting anything? And I don't really know what's happening. Okay, let me get Larathar spotting. Yes. Sounds like a plan. If you say so. Yeah, yeah. That was a All crazy right. fight. Kind of a kind of an odd Sounds setup. Like a plan. Okay, I want I'm here. I want just Larathar to move. I don't want anybody else to move. Just Larathar. If you say so. Yeah, yeah. Oh, there is something. What is this? Mephit statue. A scorched rim. And it killed him. So you've only got a second. What's up? Yes? I don't know if I've got of like course. a fire yeah. resistance or anything. As you wish. Oh, oh, right. Right. Let's move. Oh, move. Oh, yeah. <sighs> it's like you can't get him out of the way in time. No, 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 no. Okay. Stay. Get over here. I hear you. Move, move, move. Okay. There he goes again. Bye. Did you need something? Yeah, I'll take all. Move sure. back. I think you got a time when you stabilize. You move, 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 move. Oh, yeah. oh, it keeps going down. Yes. Good 
orders? All right, I'm up there. I'm done. And you're down. Here you go, Matt. Get, move. What? No, move. Oh, I can't get him. Dude. <laughs> Here you go, Matt. Move, move. All right. There was another one of those faces. Scorched ring. What is this? 25% fire damage resistance. Huh. So, I think everybody's got rings on, though. Yeah. Everyone's got rings on. So, if you time it right, you can get... Oh, come the heck on, Larathar. Why are you the only one getting hit? Alright, first of all, I think there's too many people yes, here messing up the pathing. Alright, so wake him up. Who are we doing so yet? Move! Ah, oh, son of a... This is kind of getting yes. beyond... Run! Hello. Run! Can I help? <laughs> oh, so oh, frustrating. Right. Run! <laughs> Woo-wee! Sort of fun, sort of frustrating. Good orders? It was nice to get a little ring out of that, though, just to defeat that trap and get a little treasure. That was fun. All right, we're coming up on almost an hour, so I think I'm going... Ooh, what is this? Ooh, I was about to end the video, but... Ooh, pretty. Sounds like a plan. I think, actually, we are going to end here. So next time I start the video, we can investigate this stuff. If you say so. Yeah, yeah. It'll be very, very interesting. So nice, nice tantalizing place to end the video to pick up next time. So thanks so much for watching the Shane Plays Let's Play series, Sword Coast Legends story mode. Uh, thanks so much. And if you like the video, please leave it a thumbs up on YouTube. Uh, maybe leave it a comment. That helps me out a lot. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thanks so much.